Good morning everyone, William here, a PSV3 user. Already now, I'm bringing you a US stock market outlook for tonight. Okay, as you can see, this is the latest PSV3 indicator, which is the US stock indicator. And we'll start off today and see the Alibaba. Okay, I'll be using the daily chart to see. Okay, because the market is not open yet it will be tonight okay but then as you can see here Alibaba itself have turned from red to yellow case I green so tonight if the market opens and stays above the, the opening price more upside can be seen especially they might uh, test the 182.997 level or since KSI is green they might test back the high of today's uh, this month's high Okay, which is at 187.89 okay yesterday closed at 181.49 for alibaba okay amazon itself as you can see it has been trending upwards for one two three four five days since the color change from red to yellow which is a long signal for the psv3 user okay but case size is uh, red at that time so traders who entered long here will have toned down their sizing but of course this Outside itself still gives them quite a good decent profit for this. Now as I have turned to green, so do expect some more potential upside for tonight as long as the market stays above opening price. Okay, Apple itself have been trading upwards also. Okay, following the <coughs> Dow itself, okay, trading higher and higher. Okay, this month uh, new high yesterday was yesterday we went to a high of one eight eight point zero nine. A, but then as you can see KSI day is neutral for yesterday okay so today we might see even more upside potentially KSI is still green there's no color change yet okay then the caterpillar itself okay tonight traders who are trading the US stock market can look take a look at caterpillar okay uh, KSI is great okay so from the movement itself we might see more upside okay but of course this case is great okay the upside might be limited we, we, we might even see if the upside the momentum upside momentum comes in we might see it testing back to 136.87 currently is yesterday close at 134 yesterday close at 134 but we might even see uh testing the if the moment upside momentum continues we might even see 136.87 okay but uh, do tone down the sizing if you entered long on the intraday chart. Okay. Facebook itself have been crashing for the last two days after the color change from yellow to red. Okay. And then yesterday closed at 160.03. KSI have turned to red. So for despite the others are showing more upside, this uh, stock itself is showing more downside. <clears throat> Will it be able to cover this gap? Okay, as you can see here, this one gap here. Will it be able? We won't know. As long as the market stays below opening price of today, we might even see it covering from here to here. Okay, we might, the potential way to go is to 146.29, okay, which is the short TP level. Okay, but then. Okay, we'll wait for today's opening, this, uh, tonight's opening. Google itself, okay, there's no color change on the day chart. So, uh, potentially, we might see more upside with KSI still green. Okay, for Intel itself, same. There's uh, more potential upside. But then, since yesterday closed, uh, last night closed inside the cage. So, the, it's not potentially upside, but it's potentially sideways. Okay inside the case here yes i still green okay the jnj itself yesterday tested the cage and recovered <coughs> okay but then there's a red here there's no color change case i is green so tonight still concentrate on the short side for the jnj okay microsoft inside itself uh, still concentrate on the long side yes i green okay nothing no color change yet on the day chart Netflix itself, as you can see yesterday, it went high. 
okay, to a high of uh, 370.62, but then pull back and close at 362.95. Okay, this movement doesn't show much of uh, strength. Okay, so traders who are trading, uh, the who have any metrics in their portfolio, please be careful. Especially yesterday, case I turned red. Okay, we might see a pullback. If it stays inside the cage, if it goes back inside the cage, we might see a pullback for Netflix. Okay, Boeing itself, okay, still on the downside. Okay, still concentrate on the short side for Boeing. Okay, but then since it's still inside the cage, looks like the bears and bull are fighting out. Okay, we might see some sideways movement for a few days. Okay, until unless it can close below or above the cage. Okay, that's all for US stocks. Uh, for today, okay, William signing off. Bye bye.